I'm not interested when people go cover yourself, cover yourself, because we're not sport people, we're not doing sports. I'm interested in delivering my shots to actually hurt him. And also you'll find you'll use your language as well in the talk. If you bend like that again, like that position, sometimes, okay, this is obviously unarmed, you can just grab hold of him like that, just grab his hair, or he's got short, or just like that, and just go from that position. And if you just shout, and I use a swear word, you cunt, and just hit him like that. Right. Now, at this point, he's, got, he's now sort of saying, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And it says this point, you might or might not carry on. Depends what the circumstances are, and it depends how dangerous it is. And like in all circumstances where I've hit people, for real, every single one of them has been dangerous. Every single one of them has been dangerous. And it don't take long. So, you're going to knock somebody out, you're going to hurt them, it's to incapacitate them so you can run away or disappear. And that's what I'd advise you to do. Say I'm approached behind the back of the church, right, I'm going home and I face off with two people. You think about the technique I'm going to use to knock them out. In this position, it would be as simple as this. One there, bang like that. Now from this one, I would just launch from that position, straight in with the elbow. S simple as that. Now if you hold that pad up, so Mike holds that, so you hold that on the left hand, just move to the side then. So here's the strangeness about training. If you think, I'm facing off, one, Look where my hand position is. I'm not talking to these shits who are giving it to me, like with my hands up here. I've got to be aware of one thing, their intent and possible weapons. Often, put that down, and you've seen that, a shit, you tell me, watch this. You got a light, mate? Where's this hand? Nine times out of 10, there'll be fuck all in that hand. Can you see? But he's actually threatening you. Now, you can't obviously take a chance that there's nothing in that hand. You're going to shoot me, right? Now, you have, to, you have to say to yourself, I want to get out of this, and I want to get out of this alive, and there's only one way. Now, you, and I'll assume that none of you have got a weapon of any description. You just want to get out. Now, you haven't brought this upon yourself. You want to go through life without any trouble. So it now is very simple. My martial arts, your martial arts, everything you know boils down into something very simple. How can I knock him out? This works. Bang.